Princess Eugenie is sharing the love on Valentine's Day. The royal posted a loved up snap on the holiday with her husband Jack Brooksbank, writing, quote, Happy Valentine's Day. The post comes one day after Eugenie and her cousin Prince Harry made an unexpected appearance at the Super Bowl on Sunday. They were spotted in the stands taking in the big game in Los Angeles, roughly two hours away from Harry and wife Meghan Markle's home in Montecito. Prince Harry has had a close friendship with his cousin over the years, and she is the first member of the royal family who has been seen visiting Harry and Meghan. In 2020, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex exited from royal life and are now living a more private life in the States with son Archie and daughter Lilibet. While Meghan and Harry are enjoying a more private life, Prince William and Kate Middleton have been stepping things up lately, attending a lot of royal events as of late. Access Hollywood recently spoke with DailyMail.com's Charlie Langston about how the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge are apparently preparing to one day be in charge. Kate and William are really kind of stepping up to the plate as far as leading the monarchy. Now, William is not the next in line to the throne. His father, Prince Charles, is going to be the next monarch in the United Kingdom. However, William and Kate are very much already in that kind of waiting in the wings role where they are both very much aware that they will be on the throne probably, you know, not too far in the future. I think they both know that Prince Charles is not a young spring chicken. He's not the age that Elizabeth was when she became queen. And I don't think anyone is expecting Prince Charles to sit on the throne for decades and decades to come. He will absolutely take on the role because he has been waiting his entire life to become king. But I think that his reign in comparison with the queens will be very short lived. William and Kate are already not acting as though they are already the leaders of the monarchy, but they are taking on a huge amount of responsibility, not just in terms of public engagements, but also in terms of the way in which the monarchy is run. They're making small but very important changes, opening up the monarchy to a more modern point of view, not perhaps in a way that is noticeable every single day, but bit by bit, they have kind of helped the monarchy to evolve, to kind of embrace new traditions, and to kind of maintain the important heritage of the past, while also kind of saying, okay, a few of the things that we used to do are seen as being very stuffy. They are very stuffy. Here are ways where we can kind of maintain the tradition behind these things, without making it appear as though we are completely ignorant to what the rest of the world is doing and how they're living.